if you look into your own mind, if you look into your own persona of what you consider yourself to be, normally what you call as a personality is essentially different levels of constipation. I don't like this, I can't stand this, I can't do this, I can't do that, I only like this, I cannot like that. Different levels of constipation. What causes this constipation? Constipation in its uh, physiological sense means constriction of a tract. Here, it's constriction of one's mind and consciousness that it's held. There's no free flow of life. It's restricted because your ability to experience your life is only through the instruments of your body and your mind. Either your body or your mind in some way constricted means your ability to experience life also gets constipated. This happens in many ways. <laughs> you will be surprised, many of you think you've grown out of those things, but when you're ten years of age, your mama, your uncle, I mean, your mama said something, he called you an idiot. Ah, now you're fifty, but still forty years ago he called you an idiot, it still bothers you. When you see his face, he called me an idiot. <laughs> like this it goes on. The more concretized your persona is or your personality is, the more nicks and wounds you carry upon yourself. And these are not physiological wounds to heal because they are self-inflicted wounds. These are being carried as badges of life's experience. So they don't go. Because of this, I like this guy, I don't like this guy, I love this person, I hate this person, I can't stand this person, all this has happened. Next twenty-four hours, you must do this. All these mamas, friends, enemies, nonsense, you don't have to tell them, I love you, not necessary. Within yourself, you must come to a total sense of acceptance of everything. So, somebody said something, somebody did something, somebody stepped on your foot, somebody stepped on your head. Twenty-four hours, it's a small prescription. Only for twenty-four hours, come to an absolute acceptance of everything your mental things, your emotional things, your bodily things, every damn thing, and the social things, just simply accepting it as it is. You don't have to do anything with anybody, just within yourself. If you just do this, life will happen on a larger scale.